Hello everyone, I am Exacon Exertroya, the founder of Exacon Exedra. Welcome to XCPS Smack Studio 2. Today, I'm here to reveal to you the three new characters joining the fight and of the future of my work in Smack Studio. Let's begin. The first character I'd like to reveal is character number 9. So, let's not wait any longer. Please take a look. I wonder how many people know about this character. Yu Won, also known as Guitaru Man, joins the fight in Smack Studio. This character is definitely best when it comes to gaining meter. That is your top priority, but he has a lot of tools to work with involving, well, pretty much almost every situation, including reflecting projectiles with his neutral special. There's also the fact that he does not have any throws. Once you grab, you immediately go into a throw, you gain a good amount of meter from it. So keep that in mind. All right, let's move on. Next up is the final main character in wave two. Ladies and gentlemen, please take a look at character number 10. Forgive me my impropriety. My skills must have seemed brash in the eyes of a lady of your standing. It's about time that I got myself a VTuber in my roster. Mori Calliope from Hololive is joining the fight. This character is of long range and great combo potential, at a cost of a very tricky conditional neutral special, along with a defense multiplier of only 1 instead of 1.5. So, I do want to ask that I have some input involving Mori because I don't know if she's overpowered. I need to know what I need to do. Balancing is important and there's a big reason why I'm going to be announcing later on. So I need some help with this. Nevertheless, consider playing as Mori. I hope to see how things work out. Let's move on. Last but not least, the final character. Now I know that I said in XCPS4 that there were going to be four characters. 
But of course, I couldn't make any progress involving September because of my sickness and other things I had to do, along with the fact that I had to change the bonus characters, so 3 was the only way I can work with. That involving, you know, this. Unfortunately. But, nevertheless, I know that this character is worth it for people. So, please take a look at bonus character number 1, character number 11. She is finally here. Shantae is joining the fight in Smack Studio. Now, this character is great when it comes to horizontal attacks, and has some good vertical attacks too, mainly on the ground, but nevertheless, it is good that I have managed to make this character. She was originally going to be the final character for Wave 4, but I decided to place her into the first bonus character slot for Wave 2. I had to make her. So, there you go. Great news. I obvi obviously, I just cannot believe I even managed to work with this character, considering that her transformations actually made it so well for me to work with. I thought I would have, like, big limitations, but no. I'm very glad that I did this. Alright, let's move on. This year, I have worked on 11 characters. And next year, we still have the final character of Wave 2. Bonus character number 2, character number 12, which is bound to be released somewhere around February to March, for a couple of reasons. But the biggest one is XCPS5. So stay tuned. Now I don't know if this is going to change, chances of it being so are there, but rest assured, XCPS5 will be coming soon. But for the future of 2024, allow me to go over this. This is the consistency about how much I have been working on characters in Smack Studio this year. This is 2024. I am going to be returning to Exedra Chow Combat from, from when I started doing it in 2020, in February. But I will try to work on both of these and more, of course, such as streams, content-wise involving XCPSs to reveal more things. You get the idea. But I will try to do with what I can in Smack, in Smack Studio. However, I have some great news for you all involving future characters. I have a total count of 31 planned characters still remaining. 31, with more to come. But I'm not going to be working on all these characters, they're just planned. But I will say that I am going to be doing something with 14 of them. 7 on one kind of thing, 7 on another. Theme. Whether by personality, alignment, anything. Ladies and gentlemen, what I'm about to tell you is something that is up to you. Yes, a poll, two ballots. So ladies and gentlemen, it's up to you to find out by your votes who are the next two characters that will be made after character number 12. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the dark and light poll. Please take a look. Let 
mansion in my own right. I don't buy our own rights. Blood, sweat, and tears, the trinity of them long nights. Leave a legacy, epitome of my whole life. Legends never die, legends never die. Yeah. Never compromise, yeah. I'ma take your prize. Legends never die, legends never die. Yeah. Never compromise, forever immortalized. Legends never die, legends never die. Yeah. Never compromise, yeah. I'ma take the prize. Legends never die, legends never die. I never compromise, forever immortalized. If you a legend, time to rise up. It's time to rise up. So there you go, but allow me to go over more information. In order to vote, you must have been someone who has joined the Smack Studio Discord server before this XCPS. And obviously, you have to be part of the Smack Studio community. The only exception to this is that Noir, the, my friend of mine who gave me Smack Studio, will also be given access to vote. The last thing is you can only vote once per ballot. And we're going to make sure of this that you do indeed show that it is you that voted and not using someone else's name. This is to help avoid repeats or using names of people who are in the Smack Studio Discord in order to make multiple votes. We will find, I will find ways to actually make sure this is, you know, legit, that it's verified of who's voting. But nevertheless, I hope you all enjoy this poll and I look forward to seeing who are the next two characters to join the fight after character number 12. The last thing I'd like to announce is this. A new tournament, but not a VTuber tournament, a Smack Studio tournament. I will be hosting a tournament next year where 16 people will be able to compete for a prize money of $30, but only for first place. The selectable roster is of any of my characters, including of any of my stages, but only of my content. So I hope you look forward to some time next year where I will be hosting this tournament live on Twitch. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, that is all I have to say for this XCPS. So thank you so much for watching XCPS Smack Studio 2. Stay tuned for XCPS 5 and may the best be upon all of you. Take care.